got bacon. So who you think who you think had the biggest impact out of Atlanta? Period. You know what? Right now, I'm having an issue because I'm I'm sliding towards future now. Thank you. I'm sliding you towards think? future now. The biggest impact ever from Atlanta. From Atlanta. And it's, it's, you know, this is going to say, because y'all, I just argued with y'all down about this, <laughs> but out of Atlanta, I'm going to have to say Cass. <laughs> But 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 what I'm saying is we talk not up against Run DMC. You know what I'm saying? Maybe I'm old school. I was there a little bit before that. I was there for you know uh, Houdini, Run DMC, Fat Boys, Kumo, all that stuff. I was there for it. So yeah. maybe it impacted me a little different. What's the impact though? So uh, you say, hold up, what 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 did, Outca- what did Outcan do to make? But, but because they put, I feel like they put they took Atlanta. Since, since y'all are saying Atlanta, you're not saying yeah, the country. Say I'm saying I'm saying I feel like they did take Atlanta and put us on a worldwide scale mm-hmm. and so that made it easier for Future to do what he did. Now Future came in and changed the narrative of the music. No, no, what I'm saying is what I'm saying impact is it when I look at impact, I mean, okay, who changed the way shit was? Outcast came and changed and then future m- rock music the- to Atlanta. Future changed the way niggas thought, the way yeah. niggas dress, the way niggas talk. Wait, niggas got well, these niggas turning into jockeys? No, now, now, yep. now, now, yep. now, we just talked That's about that. Right now. We just talked about that and all that. A lot of that came from Wayne, let's be honest. Uh, Future and them are Lil Wayne's children. That's what we just talked about the other day. A lot of that came from Wayne. And, but we and, talking about but, Atlanta. But, but, but Wayne what, didn't but, make it cooler. What? Wayne, Wayne didn't make it as cool, though. Wayne was the first Wayne, one with he was all the first one to do it. stuff. He was the first the, one to do it, but when this boy started doing it, they started doing it. They started doing the time ten. Let's be real now. No, no, I ain't saying the future to have his own. He didn't. He he has his own lane. Future had but, a ten year domination, but, but, man. No, no, still, I, still you know I, I, I don't want to talk, talk to you about future. I'm trying to get over here. <laughs> what the hell? Like, 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 now I'm saying you, now I'm saying you a future fan, and, 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 and I'm the one that ride with him and argue his point every time. Now you ain't out there. Now you ain't no future. I'm not. He said out of Atlanta, who had the biggest impact? That I would say, I would say outcast because they put us on the map worldwide. I still hold that type of stuff as value. You know, I, like, I like, prefer like, future. Like, like I can't kill the game, and these are legends. Like they, they pioneer. Exactly. I'm gonna give them that. But I'm saying, when I look at impact, I'm looking at like, okay, when your when your shit drop, how everybody wearing the clothes and doing it. Jeezy and future. Mm. When when Jeezy drop, yeah, everybody sold dope. Yeah, right. I agree. When Jeezy drop, everybody wanted yeah. some money. Right. Yeah. When future drop, everybody wanted to be. Whatever it is, what he was doing. I'm just being real. <laughs> right, right, right. Everybody right, wanted to do this shit. He right. changed it. What he bitches start feeling like. Yeah. Niggas right. need to spend money. Right. Yeah. What niggas start feeling like. We finna fuck up the bag. Just everything. Like it just. I just seen the shit shift. Yeah. Into what them niggas were talking I mean, about. I mean, I agree. I'm, I'm. You, you, you preach it to the choir when you talk to me when it come to future. Uh, he know that. You know yeah. that. That's that's my guy. That shit shift, bro. Um, I ain't seen. And, and then I ain't seen so many rap niggas that don't mind saying. Shit, future. Yeah. These niggas don't mind saying it. Dude. Right, right. Like, shit, nah, I mean, shit. We, 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 we definitely give him, we definitely give Future his love on here. We definitely see, respect. gotta get his own six, but see, Exactly, but see, my whole thing is, but Future, he had a 10-year domination run, but he's still running at the top right now. Yes. He still got songs in heavy rotation. I mean, we're talking about Lil Wayne. Okay, but be high, but we just went through this. Lil Wayne been doing it for three decades. He has transcended every single decade. This man and every asked single. Me, so do you think? Hold on. So if you if you dropping right now, if you young nigga coming out, you want a feature from Lil Wayne or Future? If I'm a young nigga, the one I remember from the from from from, from who's the most recent, I would I would rather have one up with with one of these niggas over <laughs> it, both of them, whoever whoever's the the newest hottest thing. It with the because that's I'm business. Saying, but you gotta choose. That's business gotta choose. right though. now. You if you finna drop, who you gonna go get? Lil Wayne or Future? You I, OG. me? That's what y'all think of Future. But but I go get Lil Baby right now with both oh, both of them. But oh, the oh, question was between Future and, and Lil Wayne. Yeah. Wayne. It, Bruh. Just join us. Just come future, on over here and future, join us. Future is all time great. First of all, well, I'm, I'm telling y'all that. Okay. We're talking about impact. First of all, Lil Wayne has been a, a star since 14 years old. Mm-hmm. He, I told you, but Snoop Doggy Dog should be the logo of rap. I agree. And, and, I and, agree and, with and, that. And, yeah, I agree and, with that and, too. And, agree. And, and Lil Wayne should be the, 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 the handbook on being an artist. What does Tupac fall in your categories for greatest in, uh, in your conversation as far as artists? 
top three. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, because sure. see, I'm a Tupac guy myself. Yeah, me too. Top yeah, three. Yeah. But it was but with Tupac, that was another thing. It was now Pac to me in my heart is number one. Yeah. yeah. You know what I'm saying? But if I go back and just look at the you know bodies of work of different solo artists, I don't think that that Pop, now I think if he had lived, he would have wind up getting there. But I would still say that if I had to rank them now, I would go with Scarface slightly over Pop. I feel like that Scarface body of work, he ain't never dropped none of that. Ain't, ain't, he did it with a group and by himself. That's the problem I have with Andre 3000. See, they got Outkast as the number one group of all time, but they ain't even got Andre 3000, which he always says is number one in the top 10. He's and I number keep explaining, 12. He's number 12. And I keep explaining to him the reason why is because you got, you know, Scarface, he did it with the Ghetto Boys without the Ghetto Boys. Yeah. You understand? CeeLo did it with Goody Mob without Goody Mob. Fact. You understand what I'm yeah. saying? See, you can say what Andre would have done, but he ain't done it. Yeah. He says that we can speculate. We say, well, you know, if he played a few more years, he would have, this is what he would have did. But I he, mean, if, if you was the big it, dude, uh, ghetto market, so you should have said I took Andre's car and got my strip on instead of Big Boy's car because obviously because you got I'm something tired against of Andre you three riding on, I'm tired of you riding on Andre and, and making me feel this little and talking about Andre and we sick of it, all of us here. I'm speaking for Troy, I'm speaking for Dr. People, Bank, I'm speaking for all of us. Bank just told you we, we were hearing that shit when we we, we created duct tape. We're gonna do duct tape part oh, no, two in this moment. No, We're no. doing duct tape part I get, two. I get, I get, I get, I get, I get um, big props and respect to Outkast. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. These are the pioneers of the game, but I can't see and say that they influenced me. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I yeah. respect hats off to what they did for us to be able to do what we doing. Exactly. And you know what I'm saying? To be able to us. And I'm going to say they the greatest group of all time. Yeah. Because they from Atlanta and they have broke down barriers. That's right. But if we go to talking like UGK, I'm going I'm to talk about shit I grew up on. I grew up I'm on a UGK. UGK man, I grew myself. up on goddamn yeah. uh, good... Um, um, Ghetto Mafia. Ghetto Mafia. I grew up on that type of shit because yeah. that's what type of nigga I was. Yeah. You know yeah. what I'm saying? But then when I remove myself from who I was and just look at the facts of it, Okay, Outkast did bring this shit down to Atlanta for niggas like Future to be able to do what they do. Lil Wayne, I mean, uh, uh, Tip, Tip yeah, Jeezy, yeah, yeah. all these niggas like that, uh, Gucci Mane, all these niggas who m were my peers. You get yeah, what I'm saying? So yeah. it's like, we got to give it to Outkast. Right. Yeah, in my mind. I agree. I, yeah, I back. agree. And, and 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 another and an honorable mention too. I always want to mention him. Uh, Future is one of the greatest, but Ludacris. We always seem to oh, yeah, leave yeah, Luda yeah, out yeah, We, we always Luda. leave Luda out of everything. Luda, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Absolutely, yeah, absolutely. And he has done it by himself. And he has done it on the big screen. You know what I'm saying? So I, I, I always kind of forget Luda when I'm talking about everybody else. I want to. Make sure I shout out Luda. Yeah, no, nah, shout out Luda. I what about Luda. Kilo? What did Kilo do for you early on? Because, I mean, I, I know the West Kilo. Side, we love some goddamn Kilo. We love Kilo, too. I, 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 I fuck with Kilo, though. Okay. I fuck with Kilo. I just okay. saw him in the concert. He was exactly. in the concert. Yeah. 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 Kilo, Kilo went to Krim, you know, too, now. You okay. know what I'm saying? He, yeah. just, well, he just West Side. Yeah. He'll tell you that. Yeah, I fuck with You know, you think everything that come out of the West Side, you know what I'm saying, West Side, the best side. You got And who did you get that from? The group? Did you only put them in the top ten? Who said West Side? Who said that? Well, you talk about uh. The West Side Connection, nigga? 